5.30 a.m. An alarm rings. My heart pounds, but I'm wide awake and ready to go. 6.15 a.m. And the noise begins. The sound of screeching. You count the seconds between tube stations to distract from your own reality. Fucking sardines. Today, we make history. We are known for our guts and our glory. I can't afford to lose more men. If I give him what he wants, it means war. He was right, though. About what? About your being special. You're hanging around here, trying to make yourself invisible behind that fragile little fucked up routine. But you can't. You're anything but invisible. You're big. <laughs> and you're sort of this special mess. A candle burning at both ends. And no amount of booze or pills is gonna hide that. <laughs> is this a joke? I want you to find out why he was murdered. Go to the police. I am not the right person. Yes, you are. He's gonna kill me. He's gonna take me off. And he's going to kill me once and for all. And I just sat there in silence. They don't need to die. Stop! Punch at the nuclear hole. They don't want a devastating war any more than we do. I've sealed the border and shut down all communications. That's not your decision to make. Open up both, now. Traitors must pay. Thanks. You will try with Don't be that. Let's give it a crack. Hey, roll me can. Afraid of me, are you? You make me very nervous, Richard. You should be. Let's get back in that fucking car and fuck off. See you around, pal. Fucking mental. Fucking mental.